Thank you for visiting my channel, This is Lighthouse. Please don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and share. Please use your intuition with these messages. Use your own discernment. Everything you need to know is in the is in the box below the video. Let's jump right in. Well, as you guys can see, I just want to tell y'all grand rising. Grand rising. No more morning. Grand rising. No more morning. And to that end, Spirit moved me to come outside today to do this reading today. It feels beautiful out here. Okay. This message is for the collective. I'm using several decks today. First deck I'm using is the Wild Offering Oracle deck. First card out is Creative Blocks. This came out yesterday for Divine Masculine. I know a lot of people have collective blocks right now. Oh, well, there you go. I meant creative blocks, but the collective has creative blocks right now. If you are an artist of any kind, you can offer all work to the divine, making it God's alone. I offer this for the highest good to benefit the planet. Release me from all blocks and restriction. May this serve all who need. And look at the honeybee at the bottom of the card. This is so beautiful. This Release any abundance blocks. And I guess I meant to say blocks, but spirit wanted me to say abundance. Release any blockages you have. Ask the angels and your ancestors to show you what to do so you may release any blocks. It's time for abundance. It's time to leave all the blocks. It's time to take the blocks and build them, use them as building blocks. <laughs> Look at this, the second card out. You see, when it happens, this is what happens, money. Money coming in from everywhere. Money coming in so fast that you can't, you don't even know what to do with it. This is what happens when you release all of the blocks. All of my finances are now in divine order. Love itself knows my needs and is the source for all. I need not cling to gain or fear loss. Every need will be met through offering all to the divine. And I'm going to repeat that again. Every need be met. Every single one when you allow the universe to allow you. Excuse me. When you allow the universe to help you. Release all resistance. Release all blocks. Every single one will be met, always and in all ways. The second uh, deck I'm going to be using is uh, Work Your Light Oracle cards. The card that came out for that is the Age of Light. And I am like, yes, three, three, three when I said that. Look at this, the age of light. Look at how beautiful this card is. Look at how beautiful those colors are. Obviously, this being is standing in her full power. We are more powerful than we know. We are more powerful than we understand and we are more powerful than we realize is what spirit just told me. There is no struggle in nature. Release the blocks so you can create the life that you want. You have been training for this for lifetimes. Let's see what the, uh, the actual book says. The Age of Light. As I said that the wind is blowing. That's spirit letting us know that they're confirming exactly what we are talking about. They are always here. Always and in always. This is, this is a section. This, this book, the cards are uh, divided into sections. And this is an activated activation card. You have are now activated is what i just heard you have now been activated 444 you have now been activated you have been training for this for lifetimes mystics and sages throughout the ages have predicted this period in history and you decided to incarnate in the middle of it 
There is no mistake that you are supposed to be here at this time of great change. If you are ever feeling unprepared or daunted by the path that is calling you, know this. You have been training for this for lifetimes. You're way more than the days that have breathed. You are way more than the days that have breathed through you in this life. You're also all of the lifetimes that came before. You are also all of the lifetimes that came before. All of these experiences have polished your soul into the most, most magnificent expression that is your authentic self. Your soul has many facets, multifaceted, multidimensional. Imagine a fingerprint. Your soul is a million times more intricate than that. If you put together all of the fingerprints of all of the people that you have been, you would not even get close to fathoming how much of a unique masterpiece you are. I'm a channel and sometimes the energy is just so deep. These messages are just so profound. You came in with a clear soul plan. You came in with wisdom beyond your years. This is the part of you that longs to be seen. This is the part of you that is ready to step forward, that is ready to emerge. This is not the lifetime to stay hidden, but to step forth, to be seen and rise. Rise up, rise up, rise up like a phoenix out of the ashes. Hold the heart, hold the card on your heart and say, I call forth the soul gifts and soul training that I have received throughout all of my lifetimes. I am ready to embody them now without hesitation and without fear. I have been training for this for lifetimes. This is just so deep. It's profound because obviously I'm a part of the collective too, you know? Look at this. See how the angels and the ancestors always know. Once you know that you're protected, once you know that you're protected, you're always going to be so. Nothing can change when you know. Past believing, past believing is knowing. What I tell my daughters, what I tell my clients, what I tell myself is you don't believe your first and last name to be what it is. You know with extreme certainty there is absolutely no doubt in your mind crystal clear thoughts crystal clear focus crystal clear intentions is how you manifest anything that you want in this life the next deck that i'm using is going to be the key. look at this you see keep calm and trust god trust the higher power May you be strengthened with all power according to his glorious might. Colossians 1.11. 1 1.11 1 11 means uh, manifestation is, is in an angel number. Look it up. Look up any angel numbers. Anytime you guys see repeating numbers, look them up. Look, this is my own personal deck. Excuse me, guys. Look at the confirmation. 111 is time. It's time to leave those blocks. It's time to fly. It's time to rise up. They're asking me to to uh, another card to shuffle again to get another message. Don't be anxious about anything. The peace of God with which transcends all understanding will guard your hearts and your minds in, in Christ Jesus. Philippians 4 six and seven do not be anxious about anything the peace of god which transcends all understanding will guard your hearts and your minds in christ jesus <sighs> i feel a sense of calm right after i said that i feel a sense of calm and i hope that you're feeling it too
<laughs> wow. The deck, the next deck that I um, I'm going to be using is <clears throat> the spiritual AF deck. Vibrate so high that toxic people fall back because they are no longer, they no longer know how to approach you. Know how you can tell you're onto some hardcore personal growth. Your perspective gets bigger and your inner circle gets smaller. It may be that people who want to gossip quit texting you when you stop talking shit. If you're busy manifesting your dreams, keeping your side of the street clean and working on those old gnarly wounds that some people want to avoid in themselves, some people are bound to disappear. Be kind to yourself and to others as you outgrow people and places. 11-11, as I said that. Here is a piece of my own personal wisdom. On this journey, I have come to find that it is okay to allow, allow being the word for so many things, allow. Now we're not, when I say allow, I don't mean allow bullshit, allow mediocrity, allow less than what you deserve. But what I mean by allow is, allow the universe to show you how to do things. We're not in control all the time, even though we feel like we wanna be. That's far from the truth. Allow, let the universe show you what to do. Also allow people to live their own lives. It's, it's okay if people don't believe as you believe. That's okay. Everybody, if we all had the same belief, life would be boring. If we were all in the same class, it would be overcrowded. And I know you guys get the analogy. Let's move forward. You are not your situation. Temporary, temporary is what I just got. Everything is temporary. This too shall pass is what I got. Everything passes because it's life. One of the keys to becoming spiritual AF is to define who you are by something deeper inside yourself and further outside yourself than the world can touch. You are someone, even if you're not your financial situation, your job, your relationships, or even your body, find out who that person is and you will be unfuckable. Un, excuse me. <laughs> that sounds so fucked up. Unfuck withable. Hint, you'll probably have to do some more soul searching. Somebody's unfuckable because that came out. Be the person you needed when you were a kid. Be your own superhero. Look at the X on my finger. I'm an X man. And I don't give a fuck what anybody thinks about it because you know what? I create my own reality. Did you need someone who protected you? Did you need unconditional love? Did you need more attention? Did you need praise? Did you need to know someone had your back? You're a, you're a big kid now and you can do that. You're a big kid now and you can do that for that little pipsqueak still living inside your rib cage. Heal the inner child is what I'm hearing. When you heal the inner child, oh my goodness, the possibilities. They just showed me that, that, that screen um, back in the days, in the 80s, the more you know. And, those, and, and, and I remember those were a series of shows. But the more you know, when you heal the inner child, then you can, oh my God, you can soar. You can release the creative blocks. When you heal the inner child, when you speak life, positive affirmations, prayer, meditation, this is coming. This is a promise. This is here, the age of Aquarius, the golden age, the age of light. You are not your situation. This is temporary. Oh, a bird just flew by me and landed. Okay, let me put these up. foot is getting my my left foot is falling asleep okay the kipper deck is what i'm going to be using guys what are the messages that you guys have today oh my god i just heard run jump and do backflips man run jump and do backflips play it's time to play how you ill heal ill that's the jamaican coming out of me how you heal, how you heal the inner child is to play. 
go paint, go run, go color. I have coloring books. I always did before anything, before I knew about any type of healing. I guess I was always a big child. It's just that I knew when to be an adult, of course, you know, it's the balance. Duality, duality on the planet, Earth. We have free will, you can live any life you choose, color any picture you want, paint any canvas you want, it's your life. What, what messages do you guys have for us today, guys? You guys don't have anything to say today? That's strange. <laughs> It said, hold on a minute. Hold on a minute while we handle some business for you. Look at this. Do you see what I'm talking about, man? Do you understand? My eye is all in the corner. Do you understand? They said, that's all we have to say. That's all we have to say today. We don't have much to say, and that's very weird. They be cracking me up, man. The Kipper deck makes me laugh. Whew. I like my Dr. Seuss deck, don't laugh. Dr. Seuss has messages. The birds are just flying all around my reading right now. Do you guys have any messages, guys? Dr. Seuss. You see what I'm saying? And this is why I use the Dr. Seuss deck because I am a big child. I just saw LIC. And to me, that means two things. LIC as in license, short for license, licensing, licensure. The other LIC, which is the first thing that came to me is Long Island City, Queens. So I don't know how that resonates, but take it as it does. KK? <laughs> kangaroo and I'm getting Joey and when I think of Joey I think of friends I don't know how that resonates but take it as it resonates and leave what doesn't you guys have any messages for me today messages for the collective today X I'm getting x-ray somebody needs an x-ray the back of the card says Fox and this morning, actually, usually the fox obviously represents something sneaky, but I'm not getting sneakiness. You know what I'm getting? I'm not. Well, that, that was the bird um, giving the confirmation. The, the, this is a spirit animal. Look it up. And spirit, this morning I was, um, you know, looking through social media and I saw um, Somebody was posting a video about how a mother fox and her nine baby cubs made a home under their deck. I feel like somebody else saw that video as well. But I thought it was adorable because, you know, some people find it scary, and it would be. If it were me, I'd be scared. Because it's a wild animal. It's not like a, a cat or a dog. But, um... Look that up, look that up. I'm sorry, sometimes I drift off when spirit tries to channel messages. Do you guys have anything else to say? Hmm. See, it is L-I, as in L-I-C, Long Island City, Queens. And at the back of that is a lollipop. <laughs> See, it's time to play, it's time to play. Do you guys have anything else to tell me, tell us today? It's time to stop worrying, M-A. M-A-R, M-A-R-K. I just saw M-A and the R-K fell out. Kangaroos again, rhinoceros. So this time, spirit animals, spirit animals. Look up kangaroo and look up rhino spirit. Rhino spirit, kangaroo spirit. Those always have, animals always have messages for us because they walk the path with us. They are light workers as well. Healers, mystics, shamans. Yes, it sounds crazy, but it's a fact. Nothing on this, um, sometimes things on this journey don't sound logical because it's not logical. You see that? Two X. This is, this is I'm getting. 
the fox again, but I'm getting also, like I said, ooh, ooh, um, the spirit animal, but I'm getting two exes in a girl. It's a girl. Somebody's pregnant and it's a girl. Congratulations. She's enjoying the reading too, by the way, the girl. I don't know what her name is. Oh, it starts with an R. It starts with an R. And I'm gonna be using my own deck. Do we guys have any messages? I'm, it's getting chilly out here. And, and the crazy part is it's 72 degrees, 73, but I get cold very easily. And no, I don't have, um, I don't need any iron pills. Although I do take my daily vitamins, um, I actually take prenatal vitamins, not because I'm pregnant, but because I couldn't find what the doctor needed individually, so they had them in the prenatal vitamin bottle, and I think that is wild as hell. But then at the same time, it's hitting me now that I've been taking prenatal vitamins for a reason. Wow. Hmm. Hmm. Interesting. The one at 11 at the top, again, <laughs> confirmation. All right, this is the, I have two of my own decks. I'm going to be making more. I actually are making three. I have two. I've made two already, and I, I'm making two more. And I could see how many more are going to be coming from this. Okay. What, uh, what messages do you guys have? My foot is hurting me. Somebody's foot is hurting me. Hurting, hurting. Somebody, I hope somebody else's foot is not hurting me but somebody's foot is hurting them, their left foot. I took a job out of town. Somebody's moving. I feel a lot of people are moving right now, you know, to, to, for us to allow, allow, and for us to, um, what's the word that I'm looking for? I guess allow for, back, for lack of a better word. I just heard at your beck and call. I know that's right. And I'm hearing, I'm a genie in a bottle. Hello, that's what the universe says. I'm your genie in a bottle. Your wish is my command when you release the creative blocks. Period, point blank. Communication. This is what we're communicating to you. And commution. Commution. Commute. And it's true, shit. And then I heard Vince commute all. I don't know. Maybe somebody's getting a job. Oh, shit. Congratulations, that's the communication. Somebody's getting a job, I don't know. Maybe it's a retail job in a mall. You wanna work at the Vince Camuto store? Or shit, maybe you're modeling for him, modeling for his line. But at, either way, it's being communicated. Either way, it's being communicated, thank you. Remember now, we're in the age of light and if you manifest it, look, lingers resentment. You cannot linger resentment if you wanna manifest. Leave that shit in the past, man. And look at it. It's Spirit is having me wave it like this. Leave that shit in the past. Wave it goodbye. Why am I so jealous of you? Somebody is jealous. I don't know how that resonates. Sometimes spirit gives me whole messages and sometimes a true love is on the top. Sometimes spirit gives me whole messages and sometimes they give me bits and bits of pieces of message. 111 again. That's one of my favorite numbers to buy for Lotto. See, this is what I'm talking about, okay? Don't you wish your girlfriend was hot like me? Yeah, because your girlfriend is me, is just what I, <laughs> I just heard your girlfriend is me. <laughs> oh my goodness, and maybe that's why. Maybe somebody's jealous of that. Who gives a shit? Live your life anyway. Oh, blowing away. On with the wind, see that? Gone with the wind. I'm, I'll pick those up later. Come, come on this side, outside the camera. <laughs> Thank you. Gone with the wind. That's that's what I'm talking about. Leave that shit in the past. You see how the, the cards are just blowing away? Excuse me, my daughter's had to tell me something. Distorted energies. Teach me how to love you, and I feel that's your soul telling you that. For some people, it's a relationship. For other people, it's your soul telling you that. Heal the inner child. Oh. 
I just heard the word bomb, B-A-L-M. And not necessarily like a lip balm, but maybe lip balm. Maybe lip, maybe you're starting a lip balm business. Their spirit is reminding me of when I was pregnant. I had a balm for my nipples for, I'm sorry if that's too much information, but you know, I'm just a messenger, so somebody needs to hear this. They're, they have they have something, for breastfeeding moms, they have a balm so your nipples don't feel chapped. All right, somebody needed to hear that. Go look that up. Uh, teach me how to love you. I'm getting that it is from your soul when you heal that inner child. No more creative blocks. Let's see what else fell out here. Why I'm so jealous of you. Oh, those are the old messages. Shadow work, I just saw. Shadow work. Good healthy habits came up upside down. And obviously this message is not for everybody, but take it as it resonates, you know? Oh shit. Somebody's mouth is writing checks the ass cannot cash. I say, hello, leave the foolishness in the past, man. This is what's coming out next. Accept who you are, love who you are. Because when you love who you are, except everybody else can love you. Or the people who are meant to, anyway. I just heard, get a clue. Back in the 90s, we used to listen to DJ Clue uh, mixtapes. <laughs> the professional, I just heard, wow. Maybe somebody needs to go back to that album. DJ Clue, the professional, that mixtape. Look at this again. Look at all the shuffling I just did, and this came out again. This is self-explanatory, okay? <laughs> self-explanatory. I heard you got me fucked up if you think I'm not gonna be living my life for me. Biggie just said, um, his going back to Cali song, y'all niggas is a mess. Excuse me, y'all ninjas is a mess. Thinking I'm going to stop giving L.A. props. I don't know where that came from. Oh, and look at this. I'm out of here. Maybe somebody... Ooh! Remember the first card out? I, I don't know where it fell now, but the first card out was I took a job out of town, and so maybe it's L.A., and maybe that's the communication. I don't even know where the cards fell now. Wow. Look at this. I can't focus at work thinking about you communication is coming in about a job about this is this doesn't give me job energy this gives me love energy i know that's right the ancestors are stepping in to enforce everything i just heard the equalizer the enforcers the replacements i know that's right the turn the changing of the guard is what i just heard and i'm being moved to, to ask did you guys know that there was something as a fourth eye did you know that there was something as a fourth eye? Never mind the third eye. While you opening the third eye, look up the fourth eye is what they told me. Crystals. Crystals. Burn your, burn your sage. Have your candles. Have your crystals around you. You guys have anything else to tell me today? Oh, yes. 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 Your intuition is always right. And let me clarify that. Your intuition is always right when you release creative blocks. When you have self-acceptance, your intuition is always right. When you allow the ancestors to step in, your intuition is always right. When you release anything that does not serve you anymore, your intuition is always right. When you don't do any of those things, your intuition is fucked up. Okay? When you don't do any of those things, your intuition is not on point. Crystal, knowledge of self came up upside down. Some people have knowledge of self, some people um, don't. I'm hearing um, supreme mathematics, supreme alphabet, alchemist, toxic family and friends came up upside down. Some people still have toxic family and friends and that's part of releasing. That's what you need to release. And that, look, look, look how it came. The ancestors say that. The ancestors are stepping in to tell you that you need to release, even if it's family members. That's hard. My, my teenager told me, I said, you know what, this is real shit. 
when your A1s are not your day ones. When your A1s are not your day ones, you need to release. You already know what I'm talking about. This is a confirmation. It's an infringement on your soul contract when you're not doing what you gotta do as what you and God agreed. What you and God agreed to do. I see in Queen Bitch, Crown Chakra Activation, Summer, Law of Attraction, Self-Care, Burning Sage, like I just said. Burning Sage, Daily Intentions, Meditation, Healthy Exercise, Healthy Habits, Getting Off of Social Media, unless you have a YouTube channel or a platform that you're empowering yourself and others. Social media is meant to distract you. You understand that? Social media is meant to distract you. Why you think Amazon Prime and all them other, you know, all them other channels? You feel me? I might have to edit this, but all them other channels have every every channel, every movie have, oh, this is good, this is good, this is good. And they are. I mean, I watch them too. I'm human. But I don't let them uh, overtake me. And that's what it is. It's a distraction. It is a distraction. You have to know that. Of course you get messages here and there. Of course you go to the movies here and there. But don't let it be an everyday thing because when you are too distracted, you're not on your path. Sometimes you have to turn off the TV. When I moved into this apartment, for two months, I didn't have TV. Not because I couldn't afford it, but because I was moved to keep it off, to keep my head, one of my favorite sayings, keep your head down and keep your nose clean. And that... I'm not going to say anything other than that, but you know there's a double entendre on that. You know what I'm talking about. But when I mean, when I say, for me, keep my nose clean, is mind your damn business. Focus on your own test. Focus in your own lane. Let go of all those blocks. People, inner circle. So somebody needed to hear that. It's the inner circle that's toxic as hell, and you need to release it. Look at this shit here. You see how the cars can't make this up? Poison. Toxic ass family members, that's poison. Stoner. Maybe somebody smokes weed all day and don't do nothing else. I don't know. Inner circle I've seen again. Tell me more. Sound off and grow a pair is what I just heard. Sound off and grow a pair. Get your life, is what Spirit just said. Get your life, get your shit together. Shit's so obvious what you need to do. I hope you guys can see this stuff because it's getting bright out here. Whew. I think we're wrapping up with this message. Do you guys have, I know that's right. I know that's right. <laughs> Maybe you can't see this, but I'm gonna tell you what it says. Hot sex on a platter. I know that's right. That's what the hell time it is. <laughs> Infinite possibilities when you do what we are telling you. And I'm the channel. So spirit says when we, when we, your ancestors, your angels, your spirit guys, your spirit animals, your spirit babies. I'm going to be having a spirit baby series. And I did a reading yesterday. And I'm going to see how that works out because that reading is just very touching. We have spirit animals. We have spirit babies that help us um, on our path. Um, I feel like somebody needed to know that um, there's a butterfly um, flying above me in the, in, the, in the near distance. And I feel like that's just confirmation. The angels and ancestors are always giving us signs. You know, it's just who's tapped in, who's paying attention. You'll know when you get a sign. Learn to ask them to show you. Pack you a spend the night bag because it's time. Look what time it is. You hear me? That's what time it is. Three, four, four, four. When I said that. Four, four, four. Union. And you cannot get into union with all this other stuff. And guess what? Who cares? There's always going to be people who have something to say. So what? Vibrate even higher, live your life for you. Period, point blank. Any of any last, they said any last messages. Any last messages. I didn't say that, they did. Any last, trust, trust. 
Toxic friend, toxic family member. Distorted masculine, traitor. All of these are coming. Um, I'm seeing them, but they're not coming out. And so my, when I shuffle a deck and the messages stay here, but they don't come out, that's my meaning for you don't know about it yet. Or they think you don't know. This is your confirmation though. This is what I always say. They feel, whoever these people, distorted family members, distorted masculine, distorted feminine, uh, toxic energies, toxic friends, family members, quote unquote loved ones, you know, people who say they love you, fake as fuck people. Nah, uh-uh, uh-uh, no. They, shadow work just came out. So like I'm explaining, when it comes out here, but it doesn't fall out, this means to say that they feel that you don't know. Listen to me. When I tell you the ancestors are stepping in, okay? The ancestors want you to tell me more, tell, tell them more about how you going to... Right, look at this. Group text came out. Knowledge of self again. I want to be with you, distorted masculine. Lusting over you. You know, you know somebody. I feel like somebody needed to hear this. You know he's a liar. You know he's lusting, he's lying, and he's a damn tra- Ooh. Ooh. And I hate to give up this card. I hate the next card that's coming. I, 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 uh. I, I, I don't get that in a good way. Oh, excuse me. Excuse me. I don't get that in a good way. I don't... Can, can you see that it's smudged? When I wrote this, I guess it wasn't dry and it got smudged. And I was going to rewrite it and Spirit said, leave it just the way it is. We did this for a reason. Somebody... I hate to say stuff like this, but this is real life. Somebody's messing with a teenager and they have no business doing that. And that's why the ancestors are stepping in. Because it's not a healthy relationship came upside down. How the hell can it be a healthy relationship when you're a grown ass man with a family messing with a teenager? Mm -mm. Somebody needed to hear that. Mm -mm. Love fell upside down, nightcap. You haven't, mm, let me be quiet. Let me be quiet, Summer. I've got heaven right here on earth. I need more time, came out. You gonna need more time, all right, Spirit said, if you don't stop messing around. Any last messages? That's the last message, completion. It's the completion of this video at 38 minutes. 38 equals 11. I hope that helps somebody. I know it has. We're healers here. We're the rainbow tribe. And when I say the rainbow tribe, I don't mean LGBTQ. No disrespect, but I, you know, there's so many letters sometimes I get um, confused, but LGBT, I'll keep it at that because I have family members that are a part of that. Um, they enter, identify with that. So I'm not being disrespectful. And I don't mean any disrespect, but when I say the rainbow tribe, you look that up. Look up Rainbow Tribe Spiritual. They're telling me to tell you to look up Rainbow Tribe Spiritual because we're all here on a journey. And while I'm, um, you know, sharing my wisdom, it's very empowering when you have your own wisdom. I hope that helps. Like I said, thank you for visiting my channel, Lissa's Lighthouse. Please like, comment, subscribe, and share. You have a wonderful day. Today is Monday, Magical Manifestation Monday is what they told me to tell you. See you guys next time.